I have the most beautiful Sundays in this house because with just an iPad on my lap, I can open the doors, change the heating, change the television, or open a window. To incorporate it into your own home and to live with it, it's amazing. I'm really lucky, you know. Everyone comes through my front door and there's a very good first impression. My name's David Holmes. I was a professional stuntman. I grew up as a gymnast, competing in national and international competitions. At the age of 14, I'd done my first film, which was Lost in Space. Then I got uh, called in to do the first broomstick test for Harry Potter. I got the lead stunt double role and got qualified as a professional stuntman two years later and was working up to my accident in 2009. My injury is a C7 tetraplegic. I have use of my arms, but I don't have any dexterity in my hands and fingers. The most disabling thing is environment. Before I was living in a house that was unsuitable, so I'd have to live with on-site carers. I've gone from being very independent and able-bodied um, to living with a high level of disability now. So when you realise you know, what you've lost, to, to be able to, to work towards to gain some of those independences back, with like living in the chair, you have to think about bathing, getting to bed, access around. Now because of what we've designed here and the technology that I've got, in this house, yeah, my disability is, is not constantly ever present. I'd recommend Question for the ease of use, for the availability of being able to change it, uh, be able to program whatever you want into it. The beauty about the question system is it can incorporate loads of other third party technologies. So some of my stuff in this house is Bang & Olsen and Question could talk to that. And you know, some of it's Apple based and the lighting systems can incorporate, the communication systems can incorporate, the audio visual systems. To have something that speaks unilaterally across all of those platforms is wonderful. Questions and this, the touchscreen technology has gained me that independence. There's no grab handles everywhere. Everything's sort of integrated nicely and, and, and designed. And, you know, there's no nothing worse than you go to a disabled hotel room and everything looks really medical orientated and really disability orientated. It just makes you feel like why are they were well, the rooms so nicely designed for able-bodied people yet? The dis disabled rooms are always a second thought. Why, why just because I'm disabled can't I have a designed house? That's what I thought. So. The first night I got in, the moment that everybody left and the front door closed and I was in the house on my own, and I put on a bit of Pavarotti, Ness and Dorma and just think I get to live here now. It was a very special moment for me. Best piece of art I'll ever do is this house. But there are many, many people in this world with as severe or even more severe a disability than what I live with. And this technology is only going to give more independence for people that are suffering like I do or with something worse than what I live with.